Hello everyone, I am Jake. Today I would like to introduce to you a new product in the Mars Master Material series, Stoppy UI Widget. This widget can call the API of A1111 in UE to directly generate images. Let's see how it works. Let's complete the preparations first. First, add the API parameter to the A1111 command line and run it. The web UI can be closed after A1111 is fully started. Stoppy UI supports UE versions 4.26 and above. Enable Python editor script in plugin settings. Add Python additional path in the project settings. Select the Python directory under Mars Master Material in the project path. Find the EUW Stoppy UI, right click and run the widget. This menu allows the selection of model presets. The default ones are SD15, SD15 LCM, SDXL, SDXL Lightning, SDXL Turbo, and SDXL LCM. This list can be set in the Mars Stoppy Python file. Enter a subject name like Doggy. Enter one dog for the positive prompt. I first used the SD15 preset generating two images at a time using batch size mode. Enable custom parameters and reduce the number of steps to 10. Choose Euler a sampler. Click the Generate button. UE will not respond when A1111 generates images, but will be restored after the generation. I can change model presets such as using SDXL. Turning off custom parameters will return to the default settings and then click the Generate button again. A1111 generates SDXL images a bit slowly. You can see that these are the two images just generated. These images are in the saved subdirectory in the project folder. There is a directory named after our subject name. Four control nets are provided by the Stoppy UI, including depth, normal, outline, and reference. Stoppy UI supports image to image. I choose one of the images to save as a UE asset, and it will exist in the content root directory by default. Enable image to image and load the image. Ignore the difference in color space, which has no difference in the results. Reduce the noise value to 0.5. Change the positive prompt to one cat. Specify a random seed. I successfully created cat and dog hybrids. Let's try control net. Use the control images of the Buddha's head in the previous case. Load the front view depth map. Load it again if the image appears blurry, which is a problem with the mipmap settings. Then load the normal and outline map. Change the subject name. Change the positive prompt. Change to SD15 preset and generate. The generation is complete. These two images are in subdirectories named after the subject name. The directory named original stores the reference map, depth map, normal map, and outline map read from UE. Click Save and save the image in the content root directory in UE asset format. Next, I will introduce the two ways of combining Stoppy UI and Texture Projector. Check Texture Projector. These three buttons are ready for use. They are loading the projection material, loading the control images, and selecting the camera index. The automatic prompt function is also enabled. You can also turn off the option and use the entered prompt completely. Find the series of control images generated previously using Texture Projector. Load any image. Automatically recognizes the subject name. Enter the positive prompt, boot. Enable control net. I have generated images from each camera angle. In the scene is the rig corresponding to the control images. 
we use the texture projector to load. Please see the video link in the description for tips on using texture projector. Create a projection material enabling all layers. Load the projection material into the Stoppy UI. Pick an image for each angle. With the Stoppy UI, we do not need to switch to the A1111 web UI but directly generate images in UE, select images, and automatically attach textures to materials. I will introduce the new Stoppy Link dynamic function of the texture projector. Import the Buddha head model and point its front towards the plus X axis. The Stoppy Link option is added in the texture projector of UE 4.26 version and above. Enable the option. Run the Stoppy UI at the same time. Create a projection material that will synchronize to the Stoppy UI. Create all control images and synchronize them with Stoppy UI. These control images are only in memory. You can see that all the images have been loaded automatically. Reduce view range. Recreate the control images. The image has been generated and automatically applied. The layer order has also been adjusted. Switch between images to see which one fits better. With the Stoppy UI, Texture Projector eliminates repetitive process steps such as outputting control images, generating images in A1111, importing images, and replacing textures. We don't need to save current textures for each side, but bake the final result using Property Baker. It is more convenient and efficient to use. Finally, let me introduce the Stoppy UI presets. Find Mars underscore Stoppy dot PY in the Mars Master Materials Python subdirectory of your project path. Open it with text editing software such as Notepad++. The default web UI address of A1111 is the one listed. Generally, it does not need to be touched. The temporary storage directory will be in the project's saved directory. Because my video memory is not enough, I use low VRAM mode. Change to false if your video memory is greater than 6G. It is a list of models in the Stoppy UI that you can customize. This is the sampler list which allows customization. Samplers must be the same as the name in A1111. You can choose and copy your commonly used ones from A1111. This part corresponds to the various configurations preset for each model. The resolution is 512 or 1024. I use Absolute Reality for the SD15 checkpoint and Absolute Reality LCM for the SD15 LCM. I use Juggernaut XL for the SDXL checkpoint and Juggernaut Lightning for the SDXL Lightning. Just copy the name of your commonly used model from A1111. There are also VAE, Steps, CFG, Stop Layer, and Control Net model settings. This part is the texture projector preset, which includes automatic prompt and camera angle settings. By default, the camera in the X direction looks toward the front of the subject, which is the plus X axis. Thank you all for watching. On a bright sunny day, the birds start to sing. As the gentle breeze blows, it dances on my skin. I feel the warmth. 
of the sun filling up the air It's like a symphony of nature everywhere The sound of the waves crashing along the shore 